Hello, everyone. Welcome. Hello, everyone. Welcome to the Bayview Bistro. I'm San Francisco Mayor London Breed, and I got to tell you, first of all, when it's hot in San Francisco, it's hot in the Bayview. I mean, really hot, because on a regular basis in the Bayview and Patrol Hill neighborhoods and the Mission, we know that those are the hot spots in San Francisco. I just came from the sunset, and it's hot in the sunset. So I knew it was going to be even hotter in the Bayview. So I'm really excited to be here today because nothing brings the community together like food. And here is an incredible opportunity to really not only enjoy the delicious food provided by some amazing vendors, but this is also an opportunity for the community to come together. Now, when I was growing up in San Francisco, we had food houses, remember? <laughs> We could go to somebody's house and buy some nachos or some chicken or some banana pudding, uh, but times have changed. And so we don't have the grandmothers and, and the folks who are the ones that were taking care of the community the same way that we do now. Things have changed. The community's changed a lot. We know the Bayview Hunters Point community uh, has a thriving African-American population here. A uh, community filled with love and excitement and the need for us to come together for occasions like this. Especially because we know that as there's a lot of work that is happening in the Bayview Hunters Point community, there are also a lot of people working in this community. There's a lot of people living in this community. And so having amazing food options for and by the people of this community is critical to the success the long-term success and stability of the Bayview Hunters Point community. I am so excited. Big H is here with Big H Barbecue. And if you're from Hunters Point and you don't know Harold, then you're not from Hunters Point. Big H is going to turn it out with some great food. We got soul bowls. And we have yes, people, yes, 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 we have yes pudding. Well, all things sweet. And so today is really about making sure that we support them and we support what they're trying to do here for the community. There are a lot of folks who are going to be working on uh, the sewage plant and other projects. We just broke ground on one of the public safety buildings that's not too far from here. And so I was just thinking to myself, what was that building that we just broke ground on? The forensic building and, and some other something. Traffic company, thank you. Traffic and forensic for the police department. Anyway, so we were breaking ground over there, and I was just like, I wonder where all these workers are going to eat. Where are the restaurants? And so, you know, we have Cafe Envy. We have other places here, and we want to make sure that, you know, we know that there are places to go to to eat in the Bayview Hunters Point places to hang out in the Bayview Hunters Point community. And our goal is to do everything we can to make the right investments so that this community continues to thrive. And so I just want to thank all of you for being here today to support these incredible businesses. And thank you to Harlan Kelly with the Public Utilities Commission for having the foresight to know that it's not just about rebuilding and investing in our infrastructure and making sure that the community is a part of these projects. It's also about investing in other things that play a critical role to supporting this amazing community. And with that, another amazing supporter of the Bayview Hunters Point community who used to be your supervisor and is now a public utilities commissioner, ladies and gentlemen, Sophie Maxwell. What a day. What an amazing day in San Francisco. Anytime it is warm, I mean, I never get to wear sleeveless clothes. You know what I mean? I'm always scared to death because I feel the wind's going to come up any minute. But I can relax, and we can relax and be warm in this beautiful space. And I'm really proud to be a commissioner. Thank you so much, Mayor. I fought it. But it's a great thing because the PUC is sponsoring this. These are the kind of things that the San Francisco 
Public Utilities Commission is doing. They're doing it because they feel they have a responsibility to San Franciscans and to people in this community. It's a place where we can connect, where we can laugh, where we can talk about issues and politics and 45 and Kentucky and everything else. We can talk here. And this is a good thing. We don't have any banks to wait in line anymore. You know, in line when you're in the bank, you used to talk to people about things. That's gone. And so Walgreens, you used to kind of meet people at Walgreens. Well, that's gone. And so we have this. And this is where we will connect. So I want to thank all of you, and I want to thank our partners. I want to thank people who have a vision, who understand that, yes, while you're building in the programs, while you're building our sewage plant, there's other things. There's other places. There are people around you. And that these people have come to the conclusion that is, yes, a part of their responsibility to help us live and thrive in this community. So I want to thank the PUC, and I want to thank all of those people who helped make this possible. And now I get to introduce one of my most favorite people. One of my most favorite people, that is Shimon Walter, because he's going to make sure that this continues, and it's going to be bigger and better Shimon Walton. Supervisor Shimon Walton. Thank you, Supervisor Maxwell. Good afternoon, everybody. Welcome to Bayview, and as our mayor said, and we always let everyone know where the sun is always shining in Bayview, California. Um, you know, this is an exciting time as I look around and see a lot of our business owners up and down the Third Street Corridor, and you know, one of our main focuses is to make sure that we have a vibrant corridor where our businesses get to thrive, not only for folks here in our community, because we want to make sure we have a place to go, like Supervisor Maxwell explained, so we can talk, so we can spend time with our families right here in our own community. But we also want to make Bayview a destination place. We want folks to come from all over San Francisco, from all over the Bay Area, to enjoy the culture, to enjoy the businesses, to enjoy the food that we have right here in our own community. And so as we look at our own businesses activating space outside, and an atmosphere like this, that's an exciting thing for us. That is something that we should all be celebrating and be excited about. So I want to thank everyone for coming over today um, and actually spending time to get to know our business owners, who I'll introduce in a minute. Uh, but I also want to talk about the public-private community partnership. As you know, the sewer system improvement program is coming. There's going to be lots of construction, lots of change in our community, and community benefits was something that we fought hard to make sure happen for our community. And working with the PUC, working with the joint venture partners, we actually got the resources to make sure that this space was activated, that our businesses were going to be able to thrive because of all of the opportunities that are on the way to this community. And we want to continue to be supportive of all of that. So I want to thank our joint venture partners. I want to thank the PUC. I want to thank the Office of Economic and Workforce Development. I want to thank Larry McClendon for his hard work on this corridor because we push Larry very hard. I want to thank Andrea Baker Consulting for all of her work on activating this space. She has been working hard to make sure that we have places like this in our community. And if you look as this is really towards the front of the gateway into Bayview, and if you continue up the corridor and we have another space like All Good Pizza, all these places right here that are community assets that we all have to remember to patronize. I don't want to just see you all here today as we have this opening ceremony. I want to see you supporting Harold. I want to see you supporting Nima. I want to see you supporting Kwanisha on a daily basis, on a weekly basis, consistently because that piece is important. We need you here every day, and not just when the ribbon cutting and the grand opening ceremonies happen. But with that said, I do have the pleasure and the honor of introducing the stars of Bayview Bistro. Uh, first, we're gonna hear from Nima Romney, San Francisco native and owner of Sobos, which is a food truck serving soul food with a Latin twist. Then we're gonna hear from Harold Big H, Bayview native and owner of Big H Barbecue, a frequent vendor at Juneteenth Festival in Winter Wonderland. And then we'll hear from Kwanisha Johnson, San Francisco native and owner of Yes Pudding, which is a pop-up serving hand-layered pudding desserts. And the last thing I want to say is 
we're going to be working hard from the District 10 office with my colleagues to do everything that we can to provide opportunities for small businesses, to make it easier for small businesses to thrive here in San Francisco, especially along the corridors here in District 10. So with that said, I want to bring up Nima Romney from Sobos. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. I first want to say um, thank everyone for coming. I wrote a script, so have patience with me. <laughs> Hello, my name is Nima Romney. I have, I have been a native of San Francisco all my life. I would first like to thank our mayor, London Breed, for taking out our busy schedule to come down and support us. Um, in no Pacific order, I also would like to thank PUC, um, OEWD, Brown and Codwell, Black and Vich, if I, I hope I pronounced that right. I think it's Beach. Uh, um, Salt Wash, Jacobs Engineering, and Emerson. Last but never least, I would like to thank Andrea Baker and Pooja, in which without their opportunity, I wouldn't be standing here today. I opened, I opened Soul Bowl October 27, 2017, with the joys and dreams of becoming a business owner. I have bounced around San Francisco because of the permit process that San Francisco has in place. So when Andrea Baker reached out to me with the opportunity of being a part of Bayview Bistro, I could not resist. My grandmother, Katie Roof, have lived in Bayview all my life. Ooh, have patience. Ooh. <laughs> so the decision to be a part of Bayview was not hard to make at all. We are facing our challenges. But with the support and the help of our community, as well as Bayview with Big H and Yes Pudding, I hope that we have high hopes and high dreams of how far this space can go. Again, I would like to thank our mayor. I would like to thank everyone for coming out. And I see my son back there in the back. Royce, I love you so much. I thank you for coming and support your mom as well. Hello everyone, my name is Harold A.G. go by Big H Barbecue, born and raised here in San Francisco, Bayview. Man, I've been kicking for a long time with my grandfather, Mr. Perkins, my mom, Dolores A.G. It's been a beautiful thing. I just want to thank y'all for coming out and supporting us. Bayview Brisco got me out here, and man, it's been a beautiful thing, man. Putting my foot in the door, trying to move up and go farther places support my family a little bit more better. But um, I wouldn't be able to do it with all y'all here. And Ms. Mayor Bree, thank you so much for all y'all coming out. I appreciate it. Y'all have a lovely day. And come get some of them real. Be over there waiting for you. <laughs> Hi, again, my name is Quanisha and I'm the owner of Yes Pudding. It is a dessert business where I create a variety of pudding desserts. Um, it all started with my banana pudding, but now it has evolved into everything pudding. So stop by my booth to learn more about my business. Um, I want to thank Andrea Baker for giving me this opportunity to grow my business here. Being here it will allow me to serve customers, gain more customers, and just gain the experience that I need to own and operate a business. So thank you. Thank you to the mayor for coming out and supporting and just thank the whole Bayview for their continued support of everyone here. Oh, all right. It's time to eat people. It's time to order up the barbecue and the dessert with the pudding and everything in between. Make sure, as was said earlier, that you not only um, show up today for the opening, but you continue to come back and support these incredible entrepreneurs who are part of the fabric of what makes the Bayview Hunters Point such a special community in our great city. Thank you all so much for being here today. Enjoy yourself. I love you too. <laughs>